Hey peeps, so I just wanted to say thank you so much for the support on this channel. I hope you had a great Christmas and holiday season and New Year's is coming up. Geography Now hasn't even really been up for all that long and it already just passed three and a half thousand subscribers, so I'm really excited about that. I, I never expected it to grow that fast. Just wanted to let you guys know I am working on the next video, Argentina, and I really hope I do well on this one because I have a lot of Argentinian subscribers that are going to be watching it and they're going to hold me accountable, so I really hope I don't disappoint them. Uh, I'm actually collaborating with a lot of real Argentinian people people here in LA, some of my friends, and I'm thinking of going to the Argentinian consulate to maybe just get some information so that they can help me with the video. Which brings me to my next point. Some of you guys have been saying, you know, Paul, why does it take so long for you to upload a video? Well, the reason is because it takes a lot of work. I mean, essentially, I have to do the research, the writing, I have to memorize key points in the script, I have to do the image searching, I have to host the show, I have to edit the footage, and I have to animate the motion graphics. I'm doing the work of like five people. The only person helping me out right now is my my cameraman Brandon who is amazing so be patient which brings me to my next point some of you have requested that I do certain countries well I'm sorry to tell you I'm doing the entire thing alphabetically oh but Paul you forgot to do countries like Antarctica and Abkhazia look I would love to cover those regions and I will later but as of right now I can only cover countries that are internationally recognized as sovereign states that operate and function in a solely distinguishable and independent manner this means countries that can do things like create their own parliament issue passports and have a currency exchange, send out diplomats and ambassadors, and have a seat at the UN, stuff like that. In addition to being widely recognized, it gets really fuzzy. CGP Grey does a great example explaining this in this video. Countries like Greenland, or South Ossetia, or Tibet, although totally autonomous, don't exactly have those facets. Another reason why I've been so slow is because if you've been following me on my other channel, you'll know that I want a trip to Finland. So the company Climate Shield is sponsoring the trip and essentially I'm going to be doing a travel vlog in various regions of Finland and Estonia with one of my very good friends Gabs as my cameraman. So in addition to doing all of the Geography Now videos, I've been preparing for the Finland trip as well. I've been trying to do all the research I can over Finland and Estonia and it's just one big jumbled mess. But I promise you I will do as many Geography Now videos as I can. I love making these videos. It's one of my biggest passions. So I just be patient. In the meantime, hope you guys have a great new year 2015 and uh, stay cool, stay tuned.